you can see a blister like effect on the tree and this can be like brown yellow green blisters on on your pear leaf it won't appear on a couple of leaves to be honest it can ravage your entire tree see those these are called pear blister mite and these pear mites are very microscopic gold mite they feed and breed on the leaf of the pear plants and they appear normally between the months of April uh, to September what they do is they suck the contents of leaf cells and their secretions cause the leaf to blister uh, on the on the areas they're, they're feeding they're very extremely small as well it's not going to damage your tree or the bark or even the fruit so that is a good news now let's see a couple of methods to get rid of them there is no chemical methods to get rid of them like any sprays or or anything that you can uh, buy from a shop so uh, the other method is to remove the leaf the affected leaves but if your entire tree is affected you can't unfortunately uh, you know remove the entire leaf from your plants now the second method is to mulch your plants uh, so buy some wood mulch or, or anything just put under your trees and uh, make sure you water your plants uh, less water can cause this uh, this problem as well now uh, in if it's a dry summer make sure you water your plants uh, every week third method is which I normally use and there is something called a, um, a neem oil you can safely spray the neem oil on your plants because I use it on all my vegetables my apple trees uh, rose plants and everything it is an antibacterial spray uh, which some people even use it on their hair so don't worry about that and um, before you spray it on your plant uh, make sure that you use it on a, a couple of leaves and leave it for two days and if there is no problem just uh, spray on your entire tree uh, if you if you're going to mix it on a five liter uh, can mix it like uh, two tablespoons of neem oil to uh, one tablespoon of washing up liquid So try these methods and hope it helps. Thank you all for watching and please do like, subscribe uh, my videos and uh, try to share them because it can help someone else with the same problems. Once again, thank you all for watching. Goodbye. I'll see you next time.